India recorded the biggest single day jump in the number of coronavirus cases with 6654 new patients in the last 24 hours. The country has registered 3720 deaths linked to COVID-19 so far. Of these, 137 patients died in the last 24 hours. A total of 51784 patients have recovered in India. According to the government data, nearly 25,000 cases have been reported in the last four days. Maharashtra reported the highest number of cases in the last 24 hours with 2,940 new patients, followed by 784 cases in Tamil Nadu. The two states have the highest number of cases in India. While Maharashtra has recorded over 44,000 cases so far, Tamil Nadu has reported over 14,000 patients. Delhi recorded 660 new cases on Friday as the number of containment zones where restrictions are in place to contain the illness rose from 79 to 92 in a single day. The national capital has the fourth highest number of cases in the country. On Thursday, Civil Aviation Minister Hardeep Singh Puri said that passengers disembarking from short-haul domestic flights need not go into quarantine. Yet, several states like Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Karnataka, Kerala, Assam, and Jammu and Kashmir later announced a mandatory quarantine for the passengers entering the states by plane. Karnataka is observing a complete lockdown today. The state government announced a few days ago that there will be total lockdown on every Sunday while relaxing restrictions for the fourth phase of the lockdown that began on May 18th. The Sunday lockdown across the state is a step to contain the spread of coronavirus. Barring shops selling essential supplies, everything will be shut till 7 a.m. tomorrow. The Indian Railways will ferry another 3.6 million migrant laborers stranded across the country because of the COVID-19 lockdown on 2600 shramik special trains over the next 10 days and will continue running such trains till all of them reach their homes.